Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today, I'm gonna show you how to show this core game activity on mobile. Some friends might want to see what games you're playing on Discord, but many gamers don't know how to display Discord activity on Android games. While Discord is popular in schools and corporations, its main user population today is still gamers. That's why Discord is full of features that make a gamer's life a little easier. One of those features is the ability to show server members and friends which game you're currently playing. Users can even request to join you via Discord activity if it's a multiplayer game. If a certain game doesn't appear in the playback status Discord, you should set it. Discord was born out of necessity as a way to communicate with other gamers while playing online competitive or cooperative video games. The history of the app begins with the release in 2009 of OpenFient, a mobile social platform for gamers on Android and iOS. Discord is popular among gamers because it has so many features and customization options. From screen sharing to adding audio bots for music, the possibilities are almost endless. Another benefit is that both beginners and coding experts can use this service easily. So, the first thing you have to do is enable the Discord activity status option by following these steps. Tap the three horizontal bars in the top left corner of the app. Then, click your circular profile picture in the bottom right hand corner. And then, click privacy and safety. Now, scroll down. And look activity status. Tap activity status and enable display current activity as a status message. Make sure your profile is set to online or do not disturb so your status will be displayed. Even when gaming on your mobile phone, Discord will be able to detect and display what game you're playing. Just make sure your profile isn't set to offline, or Discord will display nothing at all. If you've set your Discord up to display the game you're playing on PC, then it will be automatically enabled on your mobile phone. If you've enabled in your phone, it will be enabled on your PC. And that's all. I hope this video helped you guys. For more videos, Subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thank you for watching. See you again.